Happy UTRGV Day. Today we celebrate our eighth year as a university, and I'd be remiss if I did not start by thanking everyone who's helped us reach this point. UTRGV's top priority from its inception was to help transform the entire Rio Grande Valley, and I'm proud to say we've met many milestones toward that goal, especially when it comes to enhancing the well being and health of our students, staff, and faculty. Now, as we begin another academic year, I want to share some exciting news about UTRGV, points of pride and accomplishments that will help continue to propel us to new heights. First and foremost, I'm happy to announce that pending final approval of our budget by the Board of Regents in Austin, UTRGV is raising its minimum wage for full-time employees from $13 an hour to $16.25 an hour. Now, in addition, we have a 2% merit program for staff and faculty that will be implemented in December 2023. It will be in your January paycheck. And this marks the eighth straight academic year we've invested in either merit or market equity for our employees. When it comes to student success, UTRGV continues to thrive. For the fourth straight year, we've recorded a first day enrollment of over 32,000 which included more than 500 doctoral students, the most we've ever had. And recently we were recognized as the third fastest growing public doctoral institution in the country. Additionally, our first year retention and four year graduation rates are on pace to become some of the highest we've ever had and higher than the national average. And later this fall, we anticipate surpassing 50,000 graduates since our opening in 2015. Think about that. Now, we also continue to expand academic opportunities for our students. Over the last eight years, we've created and launched 43 new academic programs and certificates, and we have more under development. I've always said that our region's greatest export is people, and we're trying our best to keep students here by providing academic programs that were previously unavailable in the Valley. And when it comes to health and medical education, we're focused on several things. First of all, our new cancer and surgery center that's under construction and scheduled to open in 2025, early in 2025. Now, over the summer, our School of Medicine received full accreditation for LCME, and that'll allow us to enroll more future physicians uh, in each class. The School of Medicine also graduated its fourth class of students this year marking more than 200 graduates since the school opened in 2016. It welcomed its newest cohort of 54 students at the traditional white coat ceremony this summer. In our School of Podiatric Medicine, the first and the only one in Texas, continues to grow as it recently seated its second cohort of students. Now, our growth in research has been phenomenal over the last eight years. Uh, our total research expenditures have more than tripled since we opened, growing from $20.7 million to $64.4 million, an all-time high for the university. As a result, our National Science Foundation rankings have also skyrocketed. In the latest rankings, we were 194th, an improvement of 85 position in six years. We rank 12th among Texas general academic institutions and ahead of long-established universities such as Baylor, TCU, and SMU we are well positioned to soon reach emerging research university status. Now our efforts to expand and enhance campus life are also progressing. We continue to recruit our first marching band, which we plan to have perform at various holiday parades this fall. Be on the lookout for that. Now our football team is working hard to build this program and we'll kick off the inaugural season for football in 2025. I know you can't wait, I can't either. I encourage you to visit the website accompanying this video, which offers a detailed overview of what I've covered here and much more as well. At a time when the value of higher education is being questioned, UTRGV is affirming itself as one of the most affordable and highest quality institutions in the country. We are the future of higher education. We are the future of Texas. Thank you for joining us on this journey. These up.